Welcome back, folks, for Blaze the Maze Guide here in Fish and Planet. Uh, so, for Blaze the Maze, it's an hour long, and you're trying to catch biggest weight difference between any fish at the lake, so obviously trophy shark and a little araku. Um, now, uh, with this, be careful of details, because on this one, it does not show that you can only use float rods, but you can actually only use float rods for this, by the way. No rods stand in. One detail quick to add to with this is make sure that you have room in your keep net as you're catching these sharks so that you can keep a big one if you do in fact get it because you do need your little and biggest fish in your keep net to count at for the score guys. I will show you the setups that I do in fact use here guys. So the first one for the little fish is right here that is 20 inches or 50 centimeters on your depth. And a, I started out with a number 10 on a semolina balls, and I will go show you where I'm at here. At Orchard Shore, I always go for the little one quickly, uh, and then I get it out of the way. And if it's anywhere under a pound or a half kilogram, I just take it and go. You don't need something great. Just get something little so you can go to your shark fishing. And I cast right there in front of the lily pads. I will show you the mark here. Um, it'd be right there, uh, negative 123, 607, and like I said, you can come back and get a much smaller one later if you do, in fact, get a big one, um, but any little fish, one pound on the bottom isn't going to make as big a difference as getting a couple more chances to catch a shark, and then for the sharks, uh, I go in a boat, and I do use the, um, any of the set up or the long poles will work for this so in the shop there is a troy or a caesar uh 23 foot any of them big uh poles will work for that them long flow poles um and i will use a tenno and blood and the reason for that is to get them to go quicker bite quicker uh a 14 does work but you may only catch five or six bull sharks the whole time you're doing it whereas if you're using a uh, a 10-0 you'll catch a lot more trophies i think the, the time i won it i caught five trophies total and i caught i think 15 or 20 sharks so definitely seems like the smaller hook size is the better way to go it gives you more chances of doing it and um and what i'll do is i'll go to the boat dock and I, I'll show you all the spots on the map. They are basically the same as my shark guide when they came out, um, when it came out in, uh, when Amazon came out. Um, but what I'll do is we'll go over to this little spot here. Sometimes I'll stop here first. I quickly on my way out and we will go like this. Make sure your boat is unanchored when you do this. And then I'll back up. I, I don't do, for people that are going to ask me why I don't do the cheaty uh, insta-catch method, uh, there's two ways to do it, and I'm not doing it. Uh, you'll see I didn't do it in, when I won the comp, and I don't promote uh, taking advantage of game mechanics like that. But what I'll do is I'll wait for a, a shark to bite. I normally like to be out a little bit farther. Oh, you can see one's right here. And I think, oh, he ran off. So what I would normally do is I would hook it and then chase it. But because this pole is so long, if you point it down into the water, you can catch them. Um, but that's how you would go about catching them. And the spots for the sharks here, uh, there's a few of them. As you can see, this is number seven. Um, these are going to be super similar. I will put these up on the screen. But if you want, pause them to place a mark for yourself. Um, these are all, uh, just basically the same old marks from back when, um, the map came out. So nothing's really changed there a whole lot. Um, and if you don't, you want to use blood duck muscle works pretty good it as well. There's another mark here. And what I do is in each spot, I generally catch one or two fish. And then I move on to the next one. This is my favorite spot. This one and the one at the bottom I will show you uh, here on the map. These two are my favorite spots. They don't generally run very far. You can chase them down pretty good with the boat. 
There we go. This is the good one, other good one right here. One and two. I always try to make sure I get a trophy out of them too. Um, right there. And then also the old mark over here as well. So, like I said, a lot of these marks are just the marks from my shark video from back in the day. Um, but anyway, you can get a trophy out of each bot. And uh, hopefully you have good luck with this. Hopefully this helps you out. We'll see you next time, folks. Have a good one.